And what's going on, you bastards? Welcome back to another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle video. So today, we are taking on the Connected Hopes category. I'm going through my units right now. Uh, this is a voiceover, so this is not live. This uh, this was... I, I didn't have the most feel good about this one. I know we had, like, the potential to do it, but uh, I, th I thought we were going to come up short, but in the end, we did... Get the W. Uh, so, I don't know. It's... The team's, like, decently linked level. Except this future Gohan, actually. I, I just was like, let me give him a defense equip. And then an extra chance to dodge. And this is uh, this is the homie Red Millennium's actual uh, Pycon. 55% link levels all one. Because Pycon's... A little difficult to find nowadays. After this event, I did find more Pycons, but I was just like, oh, well, you know, at least I did it with a 55% uh, link level one, so. Uh. But first, hi there. If you liked what you saw. <sighs> Thank you. Thanks to uh, Red Millennium for his uh, Pycon. So pretty much, uh, at first, I kept Pycon on uh, rotations, and then when uh, when uh, it got a little bit harder, I off-rotated Pycon, because he would be alright um, to keep on rotation, because if he gets a Rainbow Orb, he has a high chance of dodging, and, but his defense is, it's okay, but uh, yeah, if he gets tagged with a super attack, you're just going to take a lot of of damage so i opted to pretty much uh, off rotate him uh coming up try to get them uh, support buffs you know if it came to it either get the support buff or get that nice dodge by gogeta or get that uh you know that chance to dodge for him and sometimes i had to choose one over the other uh when it was appropriate if there's like four attacks in the back i'm just gonna like i'm just gonna give him the dodge not the uh and not the support buff because we got unlucky with orbs a couple times around here. Let's see. So, what did I opt to do? I think... Okay, I did keep Ted's... Or, I'm sorry, Red Millennium's... Uh, Pycon on rotation. And then, yeah. Um, I wasn't sure. Because I saw the Mass Nien Gun. He used... Uh, he used this future Gohan. I'm just like, dude, there's no way that could really work. If uh, the, the Great Ape got a hold of him probably beat his ass and he was not he was not the best unit honestly it, i wonder if is the int future gohan not on not on connected hopes that's kind of it seems kind of dumb if he's not on the connected hopes category but the the physical one is because i much rather would have ran the uh the uh, physical one, even though he wouldn't have been able to transform, uh, his defense is a, a bit better. He's full link level tens for me, and uh, he would have type advantage in the last uh, in the last fight. But the only downside is then I would have what like four phys or four intelligence units. Uh, yeah, because I had this Goku who's Super Saiyan three already. Uh, I have. Uh, Go tanks and then this Gogeta. I kept this Goku and Gogeta on rotation for a while um, because you know they share a lot of links. Goku uh, could have had some difficulties um, super attacking because his since he kind of went over in the flash, he, he was a little little wonky with this team comp. That's where that's where Pycon uh, could come in and help. Uh, because, you know, he can give uh, the rotation some stats and some key. So, I actually, when I first saw stuff on Pycon, I'm just like, eh, dude, like, who who really cares, dude? It's Pycon. His card's kind of whatever. Like, the support's nice. Units that support are pretty good. Um, but he can actually kind of hold his own and be very beneficial for the team. Uh and I got mine at 69%. I got no Janembas, so doing Corroded Body and Mind uh, might be doomed, actually. 
So we'll see. And his unit super attack is uh, pretty good. Just that, you know, that he's like super effective against all types of stuff like that. That that adds a little bit to his damage. Even though his attack stats aren't that great, just getting that little bit extra kind of helps. Yeah, 1.7 from the uh, from the friend who's pretty much uh, just like you awoken him. And that's it. Boom, you got Pike on. I'm kind of surprised he uh, set that as his leader because he did uh, get both the GT heroes leaders recently. Well, let's see. Yeah, th we're just chugging along. This is a very scary spot. I gave Goku all those orbs. Well, he only needs three orbs to get those chances to dodge, and it raises his attack and defense by 33%, I believe. And then if you get six, he's super effective, or effective against all types. Uh, then Gogeta, you give him the rainbow. Thanks, dog. Give him the rainbow. He has that 30% chance to dodge. I think... Because I, I, I felt like we were already going at a slow pace. And we were going to get stalled out pretty hard. I feel like we were just going to take, you know, unluck, unlucky super attack. Just we can't recover our HP enough. And then we're just boom. We're just donezo, you know. And, uh, yeah, this is where, that, you know, Pycon gets both of his, uh, his buffs for uh, dodging. And then, uh... Juicing up the rotation a little bit. This this doesn't do... That actually did a lot more. Okay, that's right. And they lowered our defense. I'm just like, ah, oh, crap. I'm going to take some damage on the normals, right? But he wasn't attacking uh, afterwards. That that was That's a lot of damage that, that Goku did. And that's the, that's the third phase, man. You would think that... Uh, what is this? Super Saiyan 2? Well, I had to think about it. Super Saiyan 2 Goku in the OG event, he wouldn't have done that much. He would have done, like, maybe, like, 40k. What was this typing? He was tech, yeah. So, maybe, like, 40k or something like that. Um, I'm trying to think of a replacement I could have done for uh, the, the future Gohan, but... I don't know, man. Just, like, the Connected Hope category is just definitely not quite there yet. At least not here on Global. Uh, especially with the same name updates. Like, I could have threw... Well, Strength Gogeta would have got... I, I never... I never really liked Strength Gogeta's EZA. Because he his glaring weaknesses were still there. Which was his, like, defense, you know? You could get Rainbow Orbs to, like, increase his defense and stuff like that. But I didn't really feel like that was enough to cover up that. But, uh, hey, maybe that's... Maybe that's just me, you know? Oh, God. I hope you didn't hear that. I'm on my other account right now. I'm trying to look at... Uh, trying to look at... Other connected uh, hopes categories. But this account definitely... Is not as stacked as uh, my main. This is just like, ah, there's literally nothing to do. Yada, yada. Let me do some stuff for the stream. Uh, so we got the Patara... Or, well, Patara Fusion. We got the Fusion Dance going off right now. And uh, I... Which... I, I think it was a little early for that. Uh, but it's good. I'm just like, dude, he's going to be fine. We well, got 98k defense, which really isn't that great. And I'm, I was kind of wondering, why is his defense so low? But, I don't know. I put it... Probably should have put Gotenks in that first line. And his attack stat, I feel like, should have been a little higher. But there are some, like, links we're missing. Being linked up with Gotenks, uh, Fused Fighters. Or not Fused Fighter. Uh, experienced Fighters. And this guy doesn't have over in the Flash. I don't know. Yeah, we took, like, 45k per hit. And I'm just like, holy hell, What? Oh, yeah, so this account doesn't have shit for Connected Hopes. <laughs> yeah, this, uh... Oof. Yeah, I don't, I don't know, man. I don't know who could have been the the replacement for that that Gohan. I probably... I'll probably pause the video here and maybe take a look and, you know, we take it... Or I'll, you know, possibly do it after the video. And then future Gohan, man. I'm just like... Yeesh, because he, he has no starting defense. 
It's just that uh, he he gets damage reduction the more he gets hit, and he does I think greatly raise defense on super attack. Don't uh don't exactly quote me on that. Uh, ra oh no, raises attack and defense for one turn, so it's not even. Whew. Yeah, that's unfortunate. All right, so we got Pike on here. I opted to keep Pike on in the first slot. Um, because I didn't want to run a dual intelligence rotation here. And then the next rotation, or the next fight is strength. So I figured maybe I should just keep Pike on, on rotation to help us out a little bit. So I off rotated a, a Super Saiyan 3 Goku because he, uh, I don't know. Super Saiyan 3, or... Uh, Super Gogeta is a lot more consistent than that uh, than that Goku. You know, kind of with like damage numbers and stuff like that. Like a four mil right there. That's that's pretty fucking good. Um, so I was just like, I, I might as well keep him on. And if that was an additional super, whew, could have saved us 17k damage. And then four mil from this guy too. So their their numbers, the, like our the lower our HP. The higher, and I, I saw that, and I was just like, damn, if we get supered, I'm going to be pissed. Uh, the lower his HP is, so we had to, I think we wasted a Dokkan attack here because of that. There was no way to avoid it. We just, I don't know, I, I was pretty upset about that. You know, if Goku got a crit, and I think he's more geared towards crits. Um... Could have saved us burning the Doke on attack here on this mostly dead enemy. And then we could have could have went to the next fight against the Golden Great Ape and, you know, unloaded our uh, super attack on him. Although it probably would have been Gotenks that did it. Definitely not this uh, Gogeta. But anyway. Yeah, the uh, I think with the giant Great Ape, we get out relatively unscathed. Uh, Gohan, I'm, I'm interested to see how much Gohan, because I, I forgot, this, this was a, like, I want to say maybe like three in the morning I did this. And I don't, I don't exactly remember what the hell happened. Besides, we got the dub, and uh, we did get stalled out pretty hard. Uh, pretty hard for a while. Yeah, PyCon just, uh, Getting beat there a little bit. Uh, this is the... F is this the friends or is this one mine? That's mine. Okay. And then uh, without a, like a really good linking buddy. Yeah, you saw Gogeta's attack stat. Dipped down by a million. We got the dodge on Gogeta pretty good. Yeah, 1.5 from this guy. I mean, granted, we don't have a lot of his uh, links active. Woof. Yeah, 82... Okay, I'm just like, shit, dude. Like, when is this defense coming to play? So, with the Super Saiyan 3 Go Tanks, I was not. Because there is like a turn restriction to where that's really freaking good. And I. I'm just like, dude, I can't pull the trigger on it early. Like, we gotta save this for the last phase, pretty much. So, I hold on to the Super Saiyan 3 transformation. And, uh. Man, I wish they would update that, though. Or, like, put it in a new, uh... Kind of the new style. Just, uh... Big Bang Kamehameha, which should have been in the Broly movie, but... Ultimate Kamehameha? <laughs> I will always bitch about that. I actually spit on my phone. That was a... That was a little bit of a wet one that I didn't mean to do. Whoops. Um... <laughs> uh... It's just like, come on, dude. Why just do a generic Kamehameha? You, you made Broly and Gogeta cannon. Big Bang Kamehameha cannon. You, you made Soul Punisher cannon too. Come on. So this is a decent rotation. I say decent because... I wanted to get the double buff on each Pycon. But the orbs really were not in my favor. I had to, I had to get those dual... Uh, dual orbies for myself there. And then... Uh, the friend Pycon can still super attack, still get the dodges, but he couldn't get the support passive, so. 
um, we were looking at because he's getting attacked twice and up he similar numbers to what I just got hit there. Probably not. Uh, probably more. Probably probably be like twenty five k maybe. I kind of forgot what it was. Three point five from the Gogeta. And then just uh, Gogeta uh, came in clutch. He's a good additional. Came in clutch with some dodges. Uh, even even supering twice, are we are still taking a little damage, and with the the first Pycon's uh, support uh, ability active. And this uh this recording actually took so long that uh, the recording timed out. Oh, here we go. And there was the dodge thanks to the rainbow orb. Yeah. Okay. He so he dodged both. Um. Now, so I put Go Tanks in the first slot. Yeah, boom. Good thing Go Tanks is very orb. Like the, he's sharing a lot of orbs with or er, key with Gogeta, and he only needed one. Or that could have been a uh, big doo doo. But uh, I think eight Gogeta and just Go Tanks are the MVPs because uh, this Go Tanks. Goes freaking buck nasty when I transform into the Super Saiyan 3 on the uh, end phase. But yeah, uh, so the recording, I, it was up to 25 minutes and it timed out. I'm like, holy shit, like, I just got this phone. Am I out of space on my phone? And it turns out I got like 60-something gigs left. I'm just like, oh, maybe that's only the duration that we're, that we're missing. So I opted to keep these guys on a rotation again. I don't know if I use an item here. Because there's no way we could... Well, we only need three orbs for the dodging. And our little uh, buff. Uh, yeah, I was going to say, it might be really risky if I didn't use an item here. So I do this for Gogeta. Honestly, that was a very bad idea. Uh, let me pause it real quick. I should have got that those orbs there on the right. Uh, let's see, 1649... Yeah, I don't know. Hang on, let me let me go back a little bit. Yeah, yeah. So we used we used the item, and then there was no reason to get this many orbs. I should have got the orbs on the bottom right. So yeah, I'm sorry. I'm, I went back a little bit. That's what's kind of good about doing it this way is that I can you know, or if I was just fast enough, I could just like oh yeah, right there, got the wrong orbs. I didn't want to use a healing item yet because I knew we probably weren't going to take a lot of damage here. But then I was uh, kind of wrong. So if we uh, didn't use a Weast there and I just ate that, I would have been pissed. Because I think about this one. Yeah, we're like 17 minutes into the run. This takes a while, actually. So I'm probably going to let just let this run. We're going to speed up the video. I'll play some music. And, uh, because the, we'll try to get this video done a little bit sooner because it's already running a little bit longer. And I mean, we get the dub here later, but we'll just, uh, I'll just, uh, speed it up a little bit. You guys can see what goes on. I, yeah, I should definitely, what? Okay. I was going to say, why would I not put Gogeta in that first lap? Probably because I'm concerned with the orbs. But we were good. And then I got that for a little healing. We still got Whis active. I did not heal. Or, yeah, I didn't heal. So, and we got that uh, Pycon uh, support buff. And then 4.25 from this guy. And really good that connected because he took, you know, he took a, a health bar off him. And this wasn't good. You know, not, not the best, but then boom. I think this man has three dodge. And I was just like, God bless. That would still have done a sizable amount. We don't want to take any more damage at this point. I think we got two items? Two, three items. It might be three, man. Because, like, the, the, tech, the tech phase definitely took a while. And I don't see me living if I only had two items. I'm interested to kind of see. Okay, yeah, we had three. Now we have two. So a little bit of a yikes here. But anyways, uh, yeah. So sit back, relax, and uh, 
I'll be back here shortly. Okay, I think I heal right here. Because I'm just like, alright, now it's time for Gotenks' as passive. I'm like, shit, we don't have the uh, HP requirement. And then I had to heal to do it, unfortunately. But uh, you gotta do what you gotta do. And uh, Gotenks was well worth it. He, uh, he was putting up some impressive numbers and then... The last banner he was on, I managed to get him from 69% to 90%. So, very impressive looking. He's like mid uh, link leveled and all that jazz. So, I think, I don't think it's the first time he shows up where he triple supers. Might be the uh, second time. I keep forgetting to do that story event for uh, like the, the GT. Uh, or I'm sorry, like Shadow Dragon Saga characters or something like that. Um, where you get the orbs. I keep forgetting about that. If it's like... I always forget that. Same with the, like the Universe 6 one. And he dodged that. Which is unfortunate. I don't think we take that much damage here. We shouldn't. We did. I think I was surprised too. Because what? We got like... Was it two supers or just one? And then we had a Princess Snake? And we still took that much. I, w I was surprised. I'm like, God damn. That boy hit hard. And then uh, Gohan. Gohan is just such a risk, dude. If full power Super Saiyan 4 Goku wanted to end my life, he could, he could just snap his fingers, super attack that guy. Boom, we're done, though. But uh, we, got, uh, we got lucky there that... That wasn't the case. And uh, I'm feeling pretty confident right now. Because we got uh, two intelligence units. 
And, uh, but again, if Goku wanted to end this run for me, snap his fingers, super attack PyCon, boom, it's over, you know? So, I'm gonna let this, uh, keep running until we're, you know, really close to the end. And then, uh, we'll finish up the video. Oh, yeah, so that's where it timed out. <laughs> so, hang on. Yeah, so it took me a second to realize what the hell happened. I'm just like, wait a minute, like, what? And then, uh, so, but we didn't miss anything. I, I caught it kind of quick. Um, yeah, so anyway, I'll be back. And, uh, yeah, we can, uh, close up the video. Oh yeah, one thing I forgot to mention is PyCon's active. I don't know if I used it last time, or I, I used it on mine already. That's something I completely forgot about, which can be extraordinarily valuable here. So yeah, I remembered about it, and I was like, oh yeah, there we go. So Gotenks around 5 mil, just slicing this dude. And then 5.2 mil. Just slicing this dude. And I don't know. Did he triple? No, it was additional, and then he died. He keeps dodging the additional normal attacks, which, hey, good for him, man. If that's what he wanted, then, uh, you know, he know, he knows what he wants. And then we got a nice crit there, too. All right, so what, we're pretty much there, I guess. Um, we're pretty much approaching the end. Uh, PyCon trying to show off, then Goku's like, nah, dude, sit down. So I used the I, the last week because I'm just like, just give me the dub. This is not a team I just want to... <laughs> I'm not going to run this team on this event for my pleasure. So uh, just give me the dub. Get me out because this uh, was running pretty long too. Yeah, the whole thing I think took around 30 minutes. Kind of like this recording. Well, it's going to it's gonna be... Uh, cut down a little bit due to some uh, editing magic but uh yeah man that was uh that was kind of rough it was a uh, definitely a fight of endurance and i feel like when i do power absorption that might be it as well because power absorption isn't the greatest and you're pretty much banking everything on the lr lr boo tanks and slash buhan so, I don't know, man. I am really not looking forward to doing that one. Like, if I can be honest. And then, uh, future Gohan. Yeah, because I might use, like, Strength Boo. Or I was thinking about using the AGL Boo, which he would get smacked up. And uh, we almost finished him with Gohan, which, you know, that would have been cool. I talked shit all about Gohan. And then he finished it, but, uh, yeah. So the AGL boo would get smacked up. So I'm thinking about bringing int boo tanks. Or I'm sorry, Buhan. Because uh, at least he'll have type advantage uh, in the last fight. And he can heal us up a little bit. That's We, we just have to rely on the, the link healing. And, uh, you know, Goku trying to send us off with a nice uh, farewell. You know, every unit ever in every mode here. We got the Doka attack. Yeah, they're just like, whoa, my HP getting kind of low. Here's a super attack. And uh, I, I just didn't. I'm just like, I don't even want to bother. Let's just kick this guy's ass. You know, he can't dodge this one, so he's 100% dead as all hell. So that was Connected Hopes. Uh, let me look at the roster real quick so we can kind of go over, um, I don't know, what it maybe a decent alternative could have been.
So I'm a dumbass and forgot to unmute my mic. I was going over who could possibly be uh, some good units here in the Connected Hopes. You know, you got uh, Strength Namek Goku, which is a uh, all right unit. Um, the only thing you'd have to do is rely on his uh, getting him transformed early, which in the OG LG was a tough challenge because sometimes you get up to Super Saiyan God to not fall below 70%. Uh, I'm sure you could do it a little sooner in this event because it depends. Yeah, you know I mean, anyway, and then you got, uh, you know, you got this Vegeta, which would have been good with the Super Saiyan 3 Vegeta. You know, you get his unit active skill. So he could have been a good unit to uh, bring. Tien will be all right. Um, Int, future Gohan is on Connected Hopes that I saw. And I was like, oh, man, why didn't I bring him? And I'm like, oh, yeah. I explained why. Because there's four int units on the team. Those physical phases could uh, beat our asses. Then there's nothing really for tech. Why is Maja Vegeta on Connected Hopes, though? That's weird. Uh, then you have, like, Spirit Bomb, Zord, Goku. Hell no, that dude would just get chewed up. Especially at the last part. Hell no. And then Nail. This Vegeta would do all right, but Nail... Um, yeah, Nail without a Piccolo wouldn't look that good. So anyway, thank you, Bastards, for watching. Tell me what you thought. How did you do? And I'll leave you... Well, I'll, I'll see you in the next one. Take care.